new videos every day. Hey guys, I'm Emmy. I am a retired massage therapist and times friends and family, they like to ask me for massages. So if you're ever in that position, I'd like to give you some pointers so you know how to give them a proper massage to where it feels really good and it also helps out those muscles. So we're gonna get started today. I'm gonna show you guys how to warm up the whole back muscles. That's the first thing you should do when you get started with massage. That way you can penetrate into the muscles as you're working on certain areas. So let's get started. So we're gonna get started here. I'm using oil today because I just, well, <laughs> let's do that again, because it's not open. That's weird. Okay, we're gonna get started today with some oil. I like to use oil um, as opposed to lotion because I feel like the heat that it gives off when it warms up with the skin, it makes it easier to get into the muscles. So I just like to put the oil all over where you're gonna be rubbing so you're not pulling on skin. And then you're gonna get started. So you're gonna start up by the neck. You're gonna follow those two muscles along the spine. Just push them down. It's kind of like kneading bread. I guess. And then I follow the muscles along the top of the gluteus and then right back up the sides, down the arms, back up the arms and into the neck. Do it again. Some people like harder pressure, some people like softer pressure. Is that pressure okay for you? Yeah. And you can start to feel right around here, the muscles will start separating and loosening up for you. And after you've done that a couple of times, you can start alternating. So one down this way. pushing down there on the pelvis because that'll also help separate while you pull up here. So you're pulling and pushing. So then I'm going to move to the side. I'm going to put some on my forearm. And we're going to follow with the elbow, starting right here at the neck where the neck meets the shoulder. We're going to go down around the scapula. And use your forearm to just push that muscle down until it meets the pelvis.
So now you've gone from top to bottom, pushing the muscle this way. So now we're gonna go from the bottom back up to the top. And again, once you get up to the scapula, follow that elbow right around there to the neck. And actually, you can pull the hand down, finish it out. So now when you start to feel like you've done it quite a bit, we're going to follow up with this backhand. And we're going to start warming up these muscles up here by the shoulder and the neck. So basically it's just a basic rub and squeeze, kind of like you're kneading something. You don't want to dig your fingernails into it, just knead nice and light like you're kneading some bread together. You can follow up with one hand doing this and the other hand comes up to the neck at the same time. That always feels really good. Does that feel good? Yeah. <laughs> it's my favorite part. It's my favorite part. <laughs> even move down towards the shoulder just trying to warm up all these muscles again just pretending like it's some bread that you're kneading all over go back down here and do this kneading or what they call petrissage all over the muscles to get it nice and warmed up Sometimes if you take your fingers kind of like those little things that you can roll on your back and you can make that and you can kind of mimic that too. Rolling around, going down. Trying not to go over the spine because sometimes that can be a little painful going over bone. And that's one side. So now, same thing's gonna happen on the other side. I'm gonna start with the forearm. So again, this is just to warm up. A, right now I'm warming up the muscles along the spine, but also when we get up here, it's just to warm up all the muscles because later on I'm gonna show you specifically how to massage the upper body, specifically how to massage the lower body, and so on and so forth. So, this just helps you get in there and get those knots out and just makes the massage more efficient. So now that we've done that, go back up towards the neck again. And I like to rub my arm like this, especially with the oil, because it does heat up. And that's the one thing I really like about oil instead of lotion. Time, and I'm going to follow with this hand. We're going to 
come up here and start kneading the dough. Again, I'll leave that one hand to come up here on the neck. Thanks for watching. That was the warm up, of course, of the back muscles. So, I'm going to get more specifically into the body parts in general. So, you guys stick around, watch more videos by me. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them. And also, please, please rate my video and subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to do that. And I'll see you guys next time. If you liked this video, we have hundreds of more alternative videos ranging from sexual health to psychology to mind control. So if you liked it, go ahead and click on me to enter the Psyche Truth channel.